Hey guys, Alex975 here today, bringing you back another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get Minecraft shaders for Minecraft Xbox, PS4, PS5, and Nintendo Switch. Uh, basically, all consoles that use Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So, for this tutorial, guys, you are going to need Minecraft on your phone or tablet. It costs a fiver, or you can get it in some way, getting it for free. I don't know how to, but if you guys can... Basically, you're, you are going to need Minecraft on your phone or tablet. Also, guys, please consider subscribing to the channel and liking the video if this tutorial did work for you. So, for the first part of the tutorial, you are going to need to go into your Play Store or App Store and search up Realistic Shader Mod. Once you have searched it up, uh, hit Install and then hit Open once you have downloaded it. Once you're into it, search up EB Shader and download it. Once you have downloaded it, hit Open. Once you've hit open, it should just send you to your Minecraft PE, and you're just going to create a new world, and you're going to want to do whatever you like, make a creative, make a operator or whatever, I make a creative and operator, but that's up to you guys. Uh, so here's the important part, you're going to want to scroll down to resource packs, click my packs, now it should be at the top for you if you just downloaded it, but I've downloaded it ages ago, so it's at the bottom, I just hit activate, and that's pretty much it. And then once you're into the world, it should look like this. It should look like the shader is working for you guys. Once it is working for you guys, leave your phone or tablet on with the world on. And you're going to want to join in through your Xbox or PS4. So now go on to your Xbox or PS4. Right, once you're on to your Xbox or PS4, just click play. Go to friends. And then scroll down to LAN games and click into it. It should say download and join, but once you have downloaded and joined, uh, you should join into the world and the shader should be on for you guys. Now, uh, a couple questions I get is, can you use this shader on worlds without your phone on? No, unless you create a, a realm and join in on your Xbox or PS4 into that realm and click on pause and resource packs and behavior packs and download a true data. Or you can use a file downloader. I don't really know how to use that, but you can do your own research on that. So basically, you can only join in when your phone has created the world. And you can join in on... Your friends can join into that world and all. So yeah, you can play with your friends and all that. So it's really cool and all. So uh, I know the shader doesn't look the best. The skybox is amazing. The water is alright. It changes a bit. And the landscape in general doesn't really change. So it's not the best shader. I know that. But it's the best shader you will get for free. And an easy method on Minecraft Xbox, PS4, or PS5. So yeah, there's an easy way to get it. So that's pretty much it for the video, guys. You should have it now. I'm just going to be showing it off for the rest of the video. So guys, I just want to say go check out my second channel, AlexM975. I have started making YouTube YouTube shorts on it now i have make i'm making the youtube shorts on football videos so i know a lot of you guys wouldn't like football who uh, watch my videos on this channel but if you do go check it out i do youtube shorts uh, and i've made about 25 youtube shorts in the last two weeks so i've been consistently uploading a lot of youtube shorts on that channel uh, sorry i haven't uploaded on this channel for two weeks it's mainly to do with school and all that but me being lazy and the youtube shorts have kind of taken it up but i you guys might have noticed I have started uploading YouTube shorts onto this channel. Only one now, I know. But I'm going to be constantly uploading them now. So basically, the plan is whenever a video comes out on this channel, uh, it might not be about the video I just made, but this day after it, I'm going to make a YouTube short. And I'm going to shout out whatever video. And it's going to be about it and all that. And that's pretty much it. But hopefully, it can gain this channel subscriber and views. Because on my second channel, it's really worked well. Like, the channel was on, before I started uploading YouTube Shorts, it was on 180. And that was last month. Now, it's on 250. I think my second channel could get to 500 subscribers if I consistently upload on that uh, by the end of this year. Uh, so, this channel, I did upload it, and it went mediocre. Now, when I say mediocre... Compared to my second channel, it was mediocre. It got 300 views, which is good, but not amazing. On this channel, I know it's not compared to other videos' views. But it's a YouTube short, which you got to understand. Uh, you, you don't get a notification. People don't, like, go onto your channel and click it. So nearly all the views were completely from shorts feed, which is really good. I gained 5 subscribers from only 300 views, which is really good. And if any of the next videos can do better... I could gain loads of subscribers, and those subscribers I hopefully could convert into people who watch these videos. So YouTube Shorts have a great potential. Obviously not for money and all that. YouTube Shorts, if you didn't know, don't 
pretty much don't give you money on my second channel it's just kind of a passion project that kind of has worked out for this channel uh but yeah that's pretty much it like uh I'm going to be uploading YouTube shorts in this channel, at least I'm planning to, and I'm guessing they're going to do better and better, because I've noticed that YouTube, like, I on my second channel, like, even though the subscribers aren't really watching it, for some reason they gain more views at the start, uh, and they just gain faster and all that, even though, like, the subscribers aren't watching, I think it's because YouTube thinks it's getting a good reception or whatever, I don't really understand the YouTube shorts algorithm, to be honest, but it's working out for me, so I'm going to be using it a lot, uh, Apart from that, guys, uh, that's pretty much all that's new to the channel. I am going to be uploading pretty much the same type of videos for the next, like, month, I'd say. I'm not doing any experimental, especially when the channel's in an experimental phase. I haven't really done a big experiment on this channel in, like, a year. And this is a big experiment. Like, the biggest experiments I'll do is, like, uploading a video I don't usually upload. But this one is a big experiment, completely going into a completely different, like, a... Uh, uh, territory like youtube shorts i've never really faced like on my second channel i've had like a month of it but this could do really well for their channel my attitude was even if it does bad for my channel uh it's not like people even if people are going to unsubscribe those are people who why would they subscribe to you if they're going to unsubscribe from you if you upload like one or two youtube shorts and uh, they're not they're flimsy subscribers they don't really actually like, subscribe to your channel, so I was okay with losing a bit of subscribers if the videos didn't do well, it was complete opposite, it gained 5 on its first video, and now I'm hoping that I can gain even more subscribers from YouTube Shorts, so YouTube Shorts has really high potential of gaining new subscribers and helping this channel, so these views on these videos can gain much more, because there's not much more, like, uh, YouTube recommending on normal videos that I can get, like, I think I'm getting the peak amount I can really get, YouTube Shorts is going to help that and increase that, like, uh, bubble like increase it because we are going like a straight diagonal line which is amazing that means the channel is consistently growing and healthy but i would like a shoot up obviously so we can grow this channel even farther because i wouldn't like to wait till the summer to get new really big videos and all that and right now it's only going to get like a couple 1k videos the occasional 10k and all that that's amazing and all but i would like to see like where like I could wake up one day and the f video could do extremely well or whatever. YouTube Shorts could potentially help our channel with that. So, that's pretty much it. I was just going to talk about YouTube Shorts and all. But I hope you guys did enjoy that video. That's pretty much it. And I know I, I was just basically building a house there because there's not much to show off in a shader. But yeah, guys, uh, the channel is looking like it's doing really well at the moment. Uh, that's all for today's video, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, check out my second channel, AlexM975, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and like the video to help again to the YouTube algorithm. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.